Hello once again everyone and welcome to episode 10 Whoa, 10 Welcome to the first of a couple of episodes that we are going to spend in this place And truth be told we have a lot of things to do I was mentioning in the last episode at the end how we got this little event uh, event that's going on here we don't want to do that yet there is a lot of stuff that we have to that we have to see I have to check and also I didn't even uh, pay attention to this but all of these things the tambourines the war drums it's better if we destroy them uh, because we are going to be fighting a lot of these goblins Uh, An act of vandalism mm, has taken place. Okay. You might want to clear up this particular mess. Let's see, let's see. Uh try and tell your way out of it. Intimidation, how you like to get vandalized position. You can just fix it. We can do any of this. Right. You may have talked your way out of this one, but there will be no repeat performance. Very well. A scrying eye. Let's not do anything suspicious while it's watching. Hmm. So we got those eyes guarding. We got this as well. That is the priestess. That's like the healer. The goblins. These are all this, uh, all the shards, um, statues that are broken. We got this tambourine here as well. Let's see if we can break it. Uh, nobody seems to be looking. Let's get out of. And well, yeah. Let's see what's going on here. Poor lad. I could give you peace, you know. But no, you gotta keep silent, don't you? Where do they flee to? You stubborn rat! Please stop. Oh, a drow. I. I didn't see you there. Please, uh, if you want to have a try. So, here's the thing. I do not know if there is anyone outside right now, but what we want to do is we want to kill as many of these guys as we can. Uh, why are you torturing him? Let's see how much we can learn. Mates, looking for some forgotten thing. Said they ran to some kind of grove. He doesn't want to tell us where it is, but he can't resist forever. Course, now that you're here, we'll gladly let you take over. Uh, if I say this, I don't, uh, I don't try to get results from outside. If I do say that. Well, it's quite probable uh, Will or Karlak are gonna disapprove or something. I'm not entirely sure, but we do want to start a fight with them. Oh, oh, of course. There's weapons in the fire if you want them. Mm. Uh, uh, Come, Grash. Oops, I let's accidentally go. pressed the button. I don't think I got this we don't want this. them to leave. So let's see if I, I can get it started next. immediately. You took a life. Now yours will be taken in turn. A fair exchange. Too bad. Perhaps. I had to get the car like this improvement though. Close ranks. Guys, I was trying to get the rats. Is ever easy. The 
because the rats are fucking snitches and I'm not even kidding like they are um we got a key there some of them are spies so yeah let's see if I can get here so that way they, they cannot run away and warn the others Again. Right. What's the plan? Okay, there's that. And if I can get to jump This one should be dead Right Gonna be looting everything because we got a merchant Right beside Frankly, I'm just looking at the, at the rats. So, okay, we got that done. Let's uh, talk to the to the prisoner. Please, please, let me out. There's no reason for this. Uh, I'm looking for a droid. Name of Halsing. Halsing, I, I don't know. He, he changed into a bear, but I lost sight of him. I right, so he's, he's a bear. Alive. That's all I know. Please, get me out of here. Right. How, um, how were you captured? We... I was with a group of adventurers. We came here for an artifact. It's called the Night Song. We tried to sneak past the goblins, but they, they ambushed us. I didn't think a pack of goblins could be so... <laughs> so efficient. Very well. Um... An artifact. What does it do? I don't know. The boss didn't say. Just said some wizard called Laroacan would reward us if we found Laroacan. it. It should be here somewhere. He said there was a hidden passage underneath the temple. The place was supposed to be abandoned. When we arrived. Uh, go on, where can I find the night song? I mean, we should do that because it's information and whatnot. But, uh, let's see. Brian had instructions, but... Brian. The goblins got him. They... They, they said they'd eat him. Mm. Please, please. These shackles. I... I don't want to die. Yeah, let's, uh... Let's... Thank you. Free him. Thank you so much. So, uh... So the lock clicks and opens. This guy uh, was part of the uh, of the group that was outside of the grove when we first arrived. Thank you. I, I, I better go before they catch us. I should be able to make it to the grove on my own. They need to know they're in danger. Uh, what did the goblins want with you? The, the grove. To the east. 
They wanted to know where we came from. They'll... They'll kill everyone. Please. I need to warn them. Yep. So, what's going on here? It's that... Um... Well, they want to find the grove. They want to raid it, right? And... Uh, something you can do, uh, I'm pretty sure you know, is to get Minthara as a as a companion. Well, you can align with with her and cutting to the chase. Hmm, elusive, elusive. Uh, can you stand? Can you stand still, guys? I am not kidding when I tell you these things can. Um. Gods be damned. Right. They can snitch uh, on you. Well. Yeah, as I was saying, you can get Minthara as a companion, but when you do that, uh, well, to do that, you have to ally with her and raid the growth. And what happens is that you lose Will and you lose Karlag. Just so you know, just telling you. And yeah, we are going to... We are going to get to talk to this guy here. Proper weirdo, but... Because of something I want to get done... For whenever we hit level 5 and I change Will's um, set. It's gonna be him the one to do it. And I should get a healing a little bit at least. Uh, we are gonna get to talk to this weirdo. Greetings, child. I've met few aside from goblins here. Ah, oh. are you also here to assist with the prisoner? Uh, what prisoner? The gentleman being held next door. My acquaintance is working on him, I believe. While I was thrilled to be invited here, I must confess, I find the goblins and their methods crude and primitive. Pain without purpose is a terrible thing. Wouldn't you agree? Well... I don't really know what to answer. Who invited you? Uh, a goblin? Yes. One who claims to be a master of pain. Pain is intimate and loving. But trying to discuss that with these creatures. Forgive me, but that look in your eyes... Something terrible has happened to you. Singular eye. Uh, clever man, how did you know? Because I see those same eyes when I look in the mirror, dear one. We've all suffered in these dark times. It is little wonder you bear scars of pain and anguish. Please, let me alleviate this pain. Mm. How would you do that? As the maiden of pain, the goddess Loviata teaches Lo -Lo us through penance, administered by my skilled hand. My work can grant peace and serenity, the likes of which few experience. It will be worth it. 
I promise. <laughs> Go on. I have to see this. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah, I saw your book. Let's tell him that because we want to get this done. My, an eager student indeed. Those are advanced devotions. The mistress would approve. Indicate which instrument calls to you and let us put it to work. Uh, I'm not a gentle, uh, gentle mood. Use the dagger, take the hand axe. I have what you're having. Oh, I do believe we are both going to enjoy this. Pinwheel pipes. Oh, and I are interested in how you handle pain, dear one. So there is a chance you oh. delight her, you will most assuredly receive her most gracious blessing. Trust me. Simply face the wall and we can begin. So there's a chance you can die from this, so we'll we are yes. going to be this healing maybe. Will do nicely. Good. Turn towards the wall. Ah! The pain you suffer will cleanse you. Do not fight it. Right. Yeah, we're gonna be doing this, by the way, all the time. Uh, come on, a child can hit harder than that. I believe it's a, it's a critical. No, it's not. So yeah, we're gonna be trying to play tough. We're going to make it to the end of this. You want more? As you wish, dear one. Don't wear him out entirely, priest. I might have use for him yet. <laughs> wonderful! Just wonderful! What a creep. <laughs> Uh, you look tired. Should I take over? <laughs> Wonderful. You want more? I'll give it to you. Not the worst technique, priest. Good wrist movement. Lots of enthusiasm. That's it! Welcome the pain! Let it become part of you. God. <laughs> uh, hit me as hard as you can, or I'll return the favor. This is the weirdest shit, guys. <laughs> I hope that's a promise, dear one. Just so you know, it is. <laughs> Actually. Sweet child, you bore the pain like a true believer. I could feel Oviatar's pleasure with every sting of my scourge. I am proud to have served you this penance. You could have hit me much harder. You're starting to sound like the goddess herself, dear one. Loviata herself found your performance inspiring. She has deemed you worthy of her blessing. See that? On a personal note, thank you. That was positively divine. Well, now you can see Looks like that's going to bruise. down there and the well, bottom left. Whatever you're into. We got Loviatar's love, that and that eats forever. 
Uh, here. Fame is the path to clarity. When you have 30% hit points or less, you gain a plus 2 bonus to attack rolls and wisdom saving throws. See that? And as promised, Mind's never quiet. we are giving the. Yes, I might. Your actions have not gone unnoticed. If they persist, it seems they will not go unpunished. Yep. <laughs> Your actions have not gone unnoticed. If they persist, it seems they will not go unpunished. Yes, yes. Just die already. Your assault has caused panic. You may soon face greater odds than you had bargained for. What's going on with Karlak, by the way? Making me sweat. Oh. Not as bad as it could have. See, that was a rat. The rat told her to come here. Well, we got that. And yeah, no, well, yeah, I'm gonna pick it up. We have the, the trader here. Let's have a look. Mm. It's necrotic damage. Might be useful later. Uh, whenever hitting level 5 and whatnot. Should probably. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. And also. Where is it? Here. Oh, Here. Um, there. So, let's have a look at that as well. Hmm. Inflict upon a target a penalty to attack rolls and saving throws. If the attacker still has 50% or more hit points, they take 1-6 piercing damage themselves. And the dagger is quite interesting because... Uh, let's see... I don't remember what I'm looking for here, to be honest. Well, yeah, that. Um, the wielder receives um, bonus on, uh, to attack rolls and saving throws until the end of the next turn. So, we are gonna put this, both of these on will. And you might be wondering why. And well, as I've been blabbing about for the last couple of episodes, these things are gonna make sense whenever we hit um, level 5. But it's basically, if you ever play Dark Souls, this is basically an RTSR. So as you can see, we lose HP. And we can. We can hit harder, basically. But I should probably... Take a healing now. At least things have stayed interesting. Yeah, that's that. Uh, we got a few... A few guys killed. That's good. We need to get as many as we can. Uh, and here's Polo. Look at that. In his cage. Let's close the door. Oh, another key. Well, that's for the cage. <laughs> Look at this. I'm quite saved. I guarantee the story of your daring rescue of my person will live on for eons. Mm. And just how will you be accomplishing that? Volo Temp Geda. Realm renowned author, author, and tastemaker at your service. Tastemaker. Once I've written you into one of my books, there won't be a tavern in Feru you can enter without receiving a hero's welcome. We mustn't tarry, but I'd hate for our friendship to end here. Please, won't you meet me once we've both slipped the goblin yoke? Hmm.
Go to my camp. We'll take. Uh, we'll talk there once we're both safe. Smashing. Soon, my friend. Soon we can share the flagon of something liquid and a tale of daring do. I'll slip away when the coast is clear. See you soon, my friend. I simply can't wait to pick your brain. Foreshadowing. Look, there he goes. Woo. Never mind. Oh. Okay, then. Uh, if we go over there, there's a lot of things that we can do. As I told you at the beginning, at the beginning, there is a lot of stuff to be done in this place. And we are going to spend a couple of episodes here. That's... Uh... If this episode is longer than usual, that's probably the reason, because maybe I want to compact them in fewer episodes. But yeah, you know, like, we are going to see what happens. And there's a few things over here as well. There's the merchant. I think. There's the slave over there. Uh, well, a prisoner in a cage. Let's see what that's about. This is one of the bosses as well, the priestesses. Um, alongside Draw Raxling, which is that guy over there. It's also a boss. Yeah, let's see here. Ah, uh, no, not this arm because we're gonna get caught. Look. Praise is ever bleeding axe. Praise his throne of flaming iron. He's a goblin as well. Praise McLoviet. Oh, because he you watches for someone else. A tyrannical deity who treats his goblinoid followers as slaves. Huh? Trying to interrupt my prayers? Scared of a real god? You're as goomless as the rest of them. Mm. How did you land yourself in that cage? Because I'm loyal to McLoviet. Because I ain't having my head turned by some upstart god. The absolute. The other goblins seem to love her. They like feasting, fighting, and fornicating. Oh, Who well. doesn't? The absolute gives them that. Gotta know your place in the world, though. McLobbyet's kept us in line. That's what a god's supposed to do. Very well. So, let's see the... Let's see... The... The sightseeing here. Because we want to start a fight here. There are those guys there, and they can see us, I think. I'm not entirely sure. Mm. I don't know if it's this one looking at looking over there, that one. Or if it's actually those. No, they don't. Okay. So yeah, we're gonna start the fight here. And I want to place myself somewhere about here, so they don't... So this one's got 9, 15, 12. Yeah, we can kill this one in one hit, I think. And he missed Being it. Being arrested for assault. Judging by the look on this guard's face, you're getting off lightly. No attack. Very well. Well, as long as she, uh, as they don't go like away, it's all good. Missing again. Can't give 
not. Mm. Let's see with the lands that ha that does zero to five. It missed because of the blindness. Let's stand out. Yeah, it's because of the thing. It's uh, and I can't do that. Can I? Does that? And advantage because I become invisible after killing someone, and this one's dead. Very well. Let's see what we got here. The key. Yeah, let's free him first and then let's go kill the others. You think this is funny? I'll be the one laughing when things turn ugly. Safer in here and out there. So this is a trap, apparently, in the door. Sharp as ever. Fifteen, woof. No. Yeah. I got a lot of tools, don't I? Mm, no. Fuck. Okay, let's use one more. Please do it. Fuck. Let's go. Little HP, doesn't he? Let me check something. Yeah, I got them all. I have anything else? There is one there. I thought I had a lot and yeah. It's just the the everyone has one or something. I don't wanna waste like inspiration. I already did. It's not using AI anyway. That's weird. Got only one inspiration left. Ha. Look at where the absolute love gone. Dead! Thanks for breaking me out. Gonna find me a new tribe. One that appreciates the old ways. Very well then. I'm assuming we can actually like find him again at some point and something of the sort. Let's see if I can. This fucking rat, spies, and we're gonna get fighting with these guys. The van. Oh, and before anything. I think we should check if there is any before any fight. Just check if there is any um, war drums. Okay, that's dead. That one's dead as well. Let's go. And if she doesn't miss, this one should be dead too. There we go. See, if we do it that way, it's not very difficult.
Selenite mm. Temple And probably we should get fighting this uh, the priestess now. It's a lot of stuff though. Hey, there's the there's the guys here. Let me see. But let's make a save. I think we should do this one first. Ah, uh, there's people upstairs, I see. Okay, so I'm gonna do something. Uh, I'm gonna separate myself. I'm gonna stay here. Beside the wardrobe. And I'm gonna take Karlak. And... Start the fight. Never a dull moment. And let's break this. There it is. And I'm gonna place myself here just so they have to engage with me and not leave. Although I I got some damage. Yeah, I can't use it yet. I wasted all my stuff. And Karlak too. I think I'm gonna send Will here. Also wanna try to engage so they don't leave. She didn't miss, guys. That's insane. And no, no, not yet. Let's get going. Okay, so let's kill this guy. And I think I can jump here. I want to see what this is about, though. Oh, it's the necrotic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So that's not bad. On, uh, but I, I should have like um, like another turn for that to be better. Shadow Heart is pretty usual. <laughs> Missing. Let's heal Will. The necrotic damage. There's that and covered. Get down. And just get a little this closer. Time. Just blasting with the blast. Ah, uh, it's not. Yeah, you see, it's not very good with the dagger and that, but as I say, this is supposed to be uh, for the level 5 in mist. 
And I don't have the the Pokemon Strike. Yeah, mm, my bad. Please will. Okay. And yeah, that that guy has one HP, so. There we go. I could have closed the door. <laughs> okay. Let's uh, loot the guy upstairs. As you can see, we can come this way, and nothing's uh, nothing's going on. We don't get um, we don't get people fighting and that. So a lot of these arrows I always have and I never use at all. So it's, I don't know if I, I I want to sell them. Let's put all this rubbish. We are regaining a little bit of all that gold that we lost. Mm, I wonder if I can do a short rest like that and start this fight. Really? Like, first of all, let's talk to the True soul gut. Now here's somebody special. The absolute has touched you, hasn't she? Priestess gut needs to touch you too. Hold out your arm so I can mark your flesh. Well, if if we do that, we get the mark on our face, or no? I'm not letting you burn me for life on a whim. Maybe you don't need it. After all, you're special, ain't ya? Like me. She probes your mind, tangling your thoughts with hers. A familiar sensation. She too carries a parasite. Darkness seems to swallow the temple, leaving you with a vision of the goblin priestess receiving instruction from a handsome young man. One of the chosen. The vision dissolves away. You stand before the goblin priestess in the temple once again. Mm, push deeper into her mind, severe the connection. Her faith floods into you, a tide of shuddering ecstasy. Her tadpole nestles within that mania, secure, hidden. I feel you in there, digging around. Works both ways. And I saw some weird shadows swimming around in your head just now. Maybe I can help with that. Us true souls gotta look out for one another. 
Okay, let's leave for now and just let me check. We broke that wardrobe. There is no wardrobe in this, uh, in here. Mm -hmm. Seems like we're clear. There is two guys down here, right? Yeah. And... Nah, it seems like we are... We, we don't really have a reason to not start this. They are a lot, though. They are a lot, sure. Uh... Ready to figure out what's going on with those shadows in your head. Yeah, let's start it. <laughs> By my oath. Yeah, like it means a lot to us. I am ready to take your head. You think you can hurt me? This'll be good. Let's rip him apart. Right. Wait, where's my team? What are they doing here? Aren't we grouped up? Oh, I could go for a good meal. I cannot do it like on yeah, I cannot do it on, on while I'm fighting. Mm, pretty far away. That's not good. Where do I go from here? Okay, so there's those guys back there and they have to make sure they don't leave this is kind of not good these guys are soft though she's the only one with uh, some HP let's see if I can face her right Ah, uh, this is not good. The party is really far away. That armor, I think... I think it gives damage back when you hit them. This doesn't have much range, although the... She's here, okay. Don't miss it. Ah, you never fail to this point. My turn. Right. The thing is, I shouldn't really waste much time with these guys here, and I should definitely go out here and try to not make them leave. What should I do? And Shadowheart is uh, just too far away, really. Better get to work. Okay, not as bad as I expected. It's healing them. Right. And I cannot move because, yeah. It's, it, it would seem they're not doing much, the ones down there, but yeah. Oh, she slipped car like. That's not good. That's 
also not good. Let's try it again. Okay. Let my enemies fool. Right. This one, that, that one's leaving. Of course. I wanna try and, and get close. Okay. Right. I'm just gonna kill the fucking healer. You've made a grave mistake. And I'm gonna try and start making my way through here. See if I can manage to to kill those. Whoa! the hell? That was a good one, not gonna lie. What the actual fuck? Stop healing the fucking hag. Put him up. There he goes. Ah, that shit's useless. What is this? Okay. So these guys now gonna make it here. Right. God, she won't die. Today, you fool. This is going to feel good. Finally, a lot of things, a lot of things just got. Okay, guys. Sorry for the cut. Ah. Cool. This guy's. Why? Fuck, oh, it seems like I have no choice then. I don't have resources, right? Yeah. As usual. This is not good. They can make a run and... And warn people. Okay, half HP, there we go. It's not bad. But these two are rangers, are not... Yeah... I still got this one. Well, these two, really. These two are scared. Have them ready. No, 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 no. What the hell?
What the fuck was that? That and let's see. Ah, oh, one HP. That's becoming way too. What's this? Um. That's becoming way too. Come on. Need to stay focused. We can kill her already. Got these two idiots and these other two idiots that won't die because I I somehow misclicked. What do I have to lose? And I'm just gonna get real close. to use this and I'm going to ah wait I could now I already used it okay Fleet of foot. Oh, my word. probably with car like I can ah because of the icy arrow I think yeah, she's not gonna do that, is she? Mm. I'm just gonna have to try and get close. Let's end this. I'm stepping on ice as well, am I? Thanks. You are joking. And it missed again. <laughs> if it wasn't because of the Ah, oh, it's alright. We're lucky. Well, what can I say? And this guy, please just die already. Just once more, and should we go? I'm gonna try and get some shots on this one. a big disadvantage mm. what's that I am 
going to get going here. I can hear next turn. And yeah, let's see if I have a lucky shot. Oh, this is gray uh, grease. One fire arrow and we're done. That one's still alive. I passed it on because I thought it was dead already. Step it's uh, overused. Let me check. Just as far as I can come here. And oh god, this shot is so difficult. Why? Okay, she's coming. That's good. We don't want her to make a run. Mm, either way, I cannot see her. Wasting a lot of stuff. Moving. I smell blood. Let's get it. The worst fight I've ever done, I think. Got out of hand. Somehow. And even worse. Still in control. Just. Even worse than that, we don't have the spider seems poised to attack, but she hesitates, tapping her claws as if trying to communicate. The other spider echoes her. Ah, uh, I don't know what the spider hisses and attacks. I don't know why we're fighting now. What is this?
very well I managed to flee that fight and here we are at the camp yeah it's pretty weird I, I, I never had that happen but yeah we got a few things though I, I have to show you I don't think you were able to see we got this note Uh, that's Loverchop's druid who was nosing around and just some Tom Robin, uh, Tomb Robin adventure type. Calls himself Halsing. You see? Ugly name for an ugly bastard. I had a little war or two with him before the lashers put his hairy hairs in the pens. Said he thinks there's something rotten inside us, inside me. Reckons he can help get rid of the rot. I told him we don't need any help from nobody, never did, and especially not now the absolute stake in the uh, a shine to us. I says there, uh, there'll be something rotten inside him soon enough. There's a lava rancid meat down in the pens and when we cut him open, I'll make sure he stays alive for long enough for the maggots to make a nest of him. Well, so he is... Um, Oh yeah, we got this thing as well. And the world uh, bears the absolute brand. They have advantage of on death saving throws. This is a healing, I think. Uh not entirely sure. Probably should take it myself. Or give it to Shadow Heart. I don't know. We'll see. And yeah, look, look who it is. It's Volo. He's made it to camp. Let's see what he has to say. Yeah, one HP. The spider spit me down once again, and I just kept running and play the combat. Let's see. I didn't have any short rest. Quite the cozy setup you have here. I'll just make myself comfortable. Thank you so much. I was just settling in and reviewing my latest findings. Mind flares, cultists, and, of course, your esteemed company. <laughs> right. What do you know about mind flares? Why, I'm practically an expert. They've tentacles, you know. Quite shocking. The druid Halson had some kind of mind flare specimen in a jar in his quarters. A replica, no doubt, but truly fascinating to see up close. Uh, I fought one of them. Here, on the Sword Coast. Impossible. <laughs> Not only I've encountered mind flare, but I've killed one. That. That can't be. I'm telling you. Uh, I've also been infected with one of their parasites. That's quite impossible. You'd have undergone ceramorphosis by now. Ceramorphosis, tell me more. I can't attest to the specifics, but I do know that not long after insertion, the host, that's you, turns into a mind flayer. As there's not a tentacle on your head, I can only assume you haven't been infected. Right. Uh, if only your uh, your disbelief could alter facts. If what you say were true, you'd be a mind flayer by now. You? Infected by a mind flayer? <laughs> Ridiculous. Isn't it? <laughs> Okay, guys, so we're gonna do this. Those of you who know, know, but yeah. Examine me, find out yourself. Perhaps that's for the best. I'd be irresponsible not to debunk such a strange claim. If I just here in your eye, I could quickly. Oh, my dear sweet gods! 
I want rid of this thing by any means necessary. If we managed it, we'd have a specimen of incredible rarity on our hands. I'll need to research the particulars, however. Give me a bit of time, and I'll have this little issue sorted. Very well. Uh, that is a... Well, this is a bard uh, armor. I think we can keep it for the moment, in case we somewhat, at some point, want to make some sort of <laughs> bard build for someone. But yeah, there you go. Volo is gonna stay around for a little. It's gonna see if he can help us with the... Uh, the parasite. Seems like no one wants to talk. The moment. Yo, I think I sold Scratch's uh, ball. Yeah. I'm not entirely sure though. Maybe I can find it somewhere. Well, yeah, I'm, I might have sold it by accident. And yeah, let's just rest. We need to. You're gonna fast travel right now? Okay, I see how it is. I never done this before. Under the roses. Okay, so everyone's here now. That's what I did wrong. Let's go to sleep. Oh. The air is heavy. Moisture drips down your forehead. Pain shoots through your fingers. Damn. Well, yeah, pretty accurate. It's 4 a.m. right now. Just in case you're wondering, I'm pretty sure nobody cares about this, but... Uh, well, I have very little time to manage this sort of uh, this sort of hobby, and I recorded episode seven, eight, nine this very night, and it's four a.m. now. I reckon I'm not gonna have much time during the week, so I use the weekend as much as I can. Uh, okay, let's see. Well, I don't know. The ache builds as you squeeze your hands together. Were your fingers always so thick? Your skin always so sticky. Oh. Chukil gate vlaketh mazathok. Can you feel it crawling through you? Tendrils squirming in your chest, gripping your heart, piercing your belly. Your bones popping, your flesh swelling. I can. I see it in you. I feel it in me. We are lost. I will be quick with my blade. First you, then the others, then myself. Your minds intertwine. You sense a touch of uncertainty, a touch of disgust. Ah. Well, look, we can do the elephant, and since we are going to rest, we might as well do it. Then um, explore Lazel's mind. There we go. Your blood runs quicker, feeding the gnawing absence at the center of your mind. Lazel's fear grips you. Not fear of death, but fear of insignificance. Ah, oh, see. Warrior Lazel, a failure to her kind, 
She will wield no silver sword, ride no red dragon, forever unknown to the great Lich Queen Flacketh. Very well. Just so you know, you can do this, and well, you die, and everyone dies. <laughs> It's quite funny. Actually, let's um, just so we have it in the channel, you know, like, why not? Because I also never done it. Let it be so. Vlaketh Gorg Shkazai. There we go. Yep. Fuck yes. Oh, and you enter battle. All right. That's how it is then. Oh yeah, there you go. Interesting feature. I guess you get to kill a party member. Not really sure. We did lose a trader though with the fight with the last fight. Spear grips you. Not fear of death, but fear of insignificance. Great yeah. warrior Lazel, a failure to her kind. She will wield no silver sword, ride no red dragon, forever unknown to the great Lich Queen Blacketh. Be strong, you will survive this, you will please your queen. I will not let the Geich take me. I will earn Vlacketh's honor. I will wait. But know this, I am watching. If the sickness does not pass come dawn, I will end us all. Right. Hey. What is this? I came just in time. You are transforming. Oh, look at that. I know your voice. I've heard it before. Hmm. Yeah. Yes, you have. I saved you before. Is at the very begin beginning I'm here of the to game. Save you again. Don't worry. You will not become a mind flayer. Not while I'm around. I'll protect you. <laughs> Imagine hacking the grabby paw off. That's <laughs> the dark urge. Take the hand offered to you. Do we trust her, guys? We haven't much time, so listen closely. There is great potential within you. It comes from that parasite. Your instinct is to resist the power it gives, but you must accept it. Nurture it. Um. I will keep it from consuming you. But for the sake of both of us, you must learn to wield it. What do you think, guys? A 
a fight for the fate of Faerun. A fight we are losing. For now. You can change that, but only if you embrace your potential. I have to go. The enemy is closing in. I will be back. Damn, yeet. Wake now. You'll feel better. I promise. I don't know, guys. What do you think? Do we trust her? <sighs> hey, the dog wants to talk. Uh, Sharp as ever. Should have done this. We had one of these interactions at some point before, and I didn't use it properly uh, let's see the dog holds a well-chewed ball in his mouth oh there's the ball I all thought... right it's only fair that you enjoy it too but if you feel like throwing it i wouldn't mind that at all Uh, yeah, we never discussed that. I'm sorry about what happened to your master. Master? Friend. I stayed with him until... Until I knew he was gone. I'll never forget him. But I'm glad to have met you. Good boy. Yeah, we got the ball now. I thought I had it and I sold it or something. Uh, no, that's that. You can throw it. I think you also get it. And then he brings it back. It's pretty cool. I've got a long road ahead. Yeah, Bolo, what do you have to say? Ah, my good fellow. Quite the cozy setup you have here. Yes, yes, Bolo, I'll yes. I'll just make myself comfortable. Thank you so much. Uh, has your research thrown up anything that might help with this parasite problem? My research turned up a rather brilliant technique that seems quite actionable. Ah. It's not too deep. Just behind the orbital socket. I could attempt an extraction. I've a needle in my tunic, after all. A needle? Gods be damned, Polo. How many times have you done this before? I saw you. I've dreamt of it a thousand times over. Ah, oh, is that so? God. <laughs> uh, do it. Volo carefully holds one of your eyes open and begins to prod uncertainly. Dude, we have the such needle. good eyes, like I. Let him carry on. The needle finds the gap between eyeball and socket. Volo frowns and begins to push. God. God forsaken, man, what that? Body <laughs> as the needle snags on your optic nerve. I Jesus. I have it. The needle seesaws back and forth, plucking the nerve like a harp string. Oh, bother. There's some obstacle in the way. That's my I fucking need brain. A more robust implement. <sighs> carefully withdraws the needle from your eye, then reaching into his bag. I didn't do this, by the way. Produces an ice pick. God. Volo slowly brings the ice pick closer to your eye. Now, 
Don't move. Oh, God, okay. Cold metal presses against the skin beneath your brow. And then... Tap, tap, stab. Fucking hell, man. Do you feel that? Ha! I think we have to blight her on the run. I agree. It's a feisty critter. Just... A little further. Volo tears the pick from your brain with a violent jerk. Your eye plops down into the mud. Oh, God. Tret. He pauses, looks down at your eye, and recoils slightly as it sinks into the mud. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. Fucking hell, Volo. to be an amount of cosmetic damage. Ah. <laughs> uh, you knocked my bloody eye out. Please, try not to overexert yourself. You're in a rather fragile state at present. I can't help but feel partly Partly all got. <laughs> Perhaps there is something more I can do. Son of a bitch. Take this, a far superior relic to that old jelly you were chained to. Try it on for size. And, um, it was very nice to have met you. Oh, you're gonna... <laughs> I'm sure you'll sort out your little brain problem one way or another. Far away from here, if you've a heart. Terribly sorry, my friend. Ta. Ah, oh, well. Off he goes. See invisibility, bleeding eye. Right? Where can I see this stupid thing here? Can see invisible creatures within 9 meters. Creatures must succeed a dexterity saving throw or lose their invisibility. Well. There you are. We got that now. <laughs> there it is. The damage growth upon your ocular nerve during Volos experiment is undone, allowing you to see invisible creatures. At least we got that now. I just wanna see if it's uh noticeable. I guess in a in a cinematic we'll see. Or a dialogue. But yeah, there it is. We lost the bloody eye. Uh, Volos done a runner. But I have the feeling that we're gonna get to... To meet him once again in the future. <laughs> well, yeah, there you go. I never did this actually. I remember uh, I stopped midway through. I think, not knowing what will happen, but yeah, let's get going. We got a lot of stuff to do. We loot all of these people. Yeah, we did that. It sucks that the other guys joined the fight because you know like i i wanted to pick up all of this and sell it i gonna encumber again to see i'm gonna have to send all of this somewhere else Add it to the wares and I'm gonna send it to Shellheart maybe. Mm. And also Volo it's a it's a seller, you know it's uh well not that's not the word, it's a trader. But 
he's gone. He's gone now. Uh, also, one thing to mention is here is a wyvern toxin. I didn't find it before. I don't know why. So we can go now. We can go out. And well, poison everyone. We're gonna try and poison the drink. I have. I want to check first if I have anything that can make me invisible. I think I saw an invisibility po. Ah oh, no, there it is. So yeah, I'm gonna do that because there's a chance that they um, they catch you or something. There it is. Combine. And where the hell is it? Ah, there it is. Okay, there we go. And we see. We look now. Drink, guys. A toast, to our victory. A toast indeed. Shut up and drink. You know what they say, a drink a day, the absolute... Uh, stays down they go they, they dead. I believe Must have been those I believe they get to accuse us or something you but we surely can out uh, out talk our way glows, through this courses through you authority Okay, deception. If I poison you, you uh, do you really think I'd still be here? Draw intimidation. We can do that. Consider consider a privilege. I could have just got you. Is this a? Uh... Well, let's do that. <laughs> Hard as fuck. Almost just, just. But please don't. I, I won't rat you out. I swear. Just leave me be. But this one's all right, lads. Knows nothing about no poisoning. <laughs> Very well. We. We reduce the number out here, so it's not too bad. But guys, I am diverting too much. I mean, it's just the game. It's just how it is, you know. Like you get you get set to go on a certain path, and you end up going a completely different one. We are here to rescue Halcyon, guys. So that's where we're gonna go, I believe. This is the place. Ah, uh, there is a drum here. Uh, there's a drum there. Moonrise, what a look at you for. Mm, it must be this one then. Right. So. You see, you guys see that bear? Well, it's pretty obvious by now that that's Halcyon. And, guys, this is going to be 
big time. Like, it's only combat that we've seen so far in this episode, is it not? Like, one fight after the other. And that's the thing, we get to do a lot of things in this area. So, as I told you, it's gonna be a couple of episodes. I'm doing the best I can. But, I'm already out of time, so... Next episode, we're gonna start with this, with Halcyon and, and all of that. We're gonna make our way out of here, and... Yeah. This is how we're gonna... Also, just so to mention... Mm, we are a thousand points to make it to level 5. Story. It's not that much, I would say. And once we make it there, Still things are gonna start to click. Thing. Like, Shadowheart, I wanna make a lot of changes, you know. She has that spear that makes no damage. The build is coming together. Like, we already... We almost mm. get... Uh, most of the set that I wanted for her. Regarding the electric stuff and whatnot, but it's the stats, obviously. So, I am gonna tinker a lot with that once we make it to level 5. Will as well, like, Will, I'm going to completely change him entirely. So, yeah, there is a lot of stuff to look forward to. And yeah, once again, thank you so much for making it to the end of the video. I really appreciate it. Remember, comment, like, subscribe. Tell me what you liked about this video. Tell me what you hated it. And I'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much. Goodbye.